Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> and you. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. You're out of smiles. Are you fresh out of smiles? What about you? Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Where's your smiles? Good morning, girl. My name is Anthony, you guys are the A-Team, and welcome back to another video! But tonight we are watching the A-Team! Stop it right there, I know exactly what you're thinking. Another solo video. Where's Audie? Where's the babies? Well, unfortunately I have some really sad news. So Audie went back to work yesterday for the first time in literally five freaking months. So she's having a really hard time adjusting and so I figured I'll just give her a break and she won't have to do any recording. So rest assured, Audie isn't going anywhere. She's just on a temporary hiatus. But she has a lot of cool videos planned for you guys and she has a lot of really, really dope stuff to announce coming later this month, early May. But that doesn't mean that I haven't stopped missing her. And stop right there, I know what else you're thinking. Where the heck is Amira and is Zara? And your answer, well, is also sad. Psych, I'm just kidding. I actually finally put them down for a nap. So, like I said, Autumn just went back to work yesterday. So today is the first day, I'm talking start to finish, where I've had the babies for the entire day. And it was so freaking easy. Like, it was not a lot of work. I just got them a bottle. I got them a diaper. I changed them a bunch of times. I fed them a bunch of times. I changed them a bunch of times. And everything was good. No, but seriously, I really do miss everybody. It doesn't feel like a real three month update without at least the babies. But don't worry guys, even though I'm solo, I come bearing gifts. So check this out. Look at my little Zarbar. You're happy to see me. That's the Emerald Princess, huh? Aren't you happy? Hi, beautiful. Hey. Hi, beautiful. You see them all the time. Hi, beautiful. <laughs> Well, as soon as I came over, she had her bottle in her mouth. Hi, tongue. Pushing her bottle out of her mouth and smiling at me. Hi, beautiful. You recognize my voice. Hi. Hi. <laughs> yeah, yeah, girl. Yeah. 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 Let's see, Mirror. <gasps> Say hi, Mirror Bear. Who's that? Hi. Look over there. Hi, Dada. Look at Daddy. Hi. <laughs> Look at their outfits, are so freaking cute. Where'd you what say? You? Eight dollars at Meyer. I got oh, really? Myers, yeah. Meyer's the plug. I mean, it's from Carter's, but it was at Meyer. That's so cute, huh? Look, there's Daddy over there. She's like, no, I'm looking at Mom. I'm looking at Mom. Yeah, I'm old news. I've been hanging out with them all morning, so they're probably like, yeah, we're sick of this weirdo. We want to go back to hanging out with Mom all day. There's Daddy. We want to go back to hanging out, especially Zara. Oh, man, she's all about her mama. <laughs> She really is. That's all she cares She's about. She's a mama's girl, huh? There's been times where, like, I'll try to call her at night, and she just isn't having it. Like, she wants me to give her back to... <laughs> She's grunting. She's pooping. Oh, Ooh. yeah, she is. <laughs> <laughs> she pooped four times yesterday. Oh, my God. Yeah, when Gigi was watching her, she Gigi pooped. She got pooped down by Zar. Oh, she washed yeah. her yesterday? Yeah. yeah, for four hours, so she would... Because oh, Autumn's getting ready to go back one. to work. No, oh, really? How'd yeah. it go? Good. Yeah. yeah. Feel they better now? Gag I gotta zoom in on that. Yeah, it's face. getting what worse. Is, I can, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you got some real poops now? You got some grown man? Oh man, look at that face. <laughs> oh my god! She's uh. really grunting too. <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> Leave my mirror alone. Oh my god. You're embarrassing her. <laughs> she do not care. She'll poop right on this camera. <laughs> For the world she's to see. So look at Zara. She is. Oh my yes, look, look, she's just she's, she's, <laughs> she's just her. her feet are going up and everything, huh? Are you gonna be alright? I think she's better now. 
it's all out. And then Zara's just like, yeah. No, she um, just had her. Yeah, so you can see her mouth, yeah. Oh, sorry, boo. Sorry, no. She was smiling. Are you her. gonna drool everywhere? <laughs> hi, girl. Hi, 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 hi. Aww. Hey, baby. Hey, princess. Sorry, you guys are back a little earlier than I thought, so you caught me uh, drinking Autumn's tea that came in the mail today while she was at work. <laughs> All right, that's enough rambling, but before we get into the video, guys, I just want to give a huge shout out to all of our new subscribers. We appreciate all of you guys coming. We appreciate you guys watching. We appreciate you joining one of the best teams on YouTube. So thank you, thank you, thank you for all the subscriptions, and thank you for all the views. We appreciate you. And to follow that up, guys, if you're new here, consider subscribing. We do pranks. We do reactions. We do baby freaking stuff and... I don't know what else we do. You're just gonna have to watch our videos and figure it out for yourself. All right, now, with all that being said, let's jump into the video. So the first thing I wanna talk about with you guys on this three month update is the food. The babies, they eat more. We talk about that every month and it will continue every single month. They literally eat more as the weeks go on. Their stomachs get bigger, so you have to be ready for that. One thing that we tried to do is introduce them to the rice cereal. Specifically, it was like the oatmeal kind, and it went horribly, horribly, horribly wrong. So we gave it to Azara first because she eats a little bit more than Amira, and somehow they're still like the same weight. I'm not sure how that works. But Azara eats a little bit more than Amira, so we gave it to her first, and we went to go check her diaper. It was a complete catastrophe. So she had a diaper rash within a matter of hours. It was crazy. So we, we backed off of that. We talked to the doctor about it and the doctor recommends that when you start like the rice cereal or the oatmeal that you should keep going with it. But honestly, we just felt like we could do without it for a little while. We're not really like hurting as far as formula goes. So we're gonna push that off to the side. And to follow that whole food conversation up, we wanna talk about giving them soft foods. So we originally planned on giving the baby soft foods at three months exactly, but we decided to back that off a little bit onto five months because we want to make our own baby food and we have to buy the baby bullet first. The difference between making food and buying food is that if you make it, it doesn't have the preservative in it, so it's less acidic. And if you buy it, it's more acidic, so they're more likely to have a diaper rash. Also, the last thing I want to say as far as food goes is remember that when you introduce food, always start with the vegetables first because as far as going like fruits and anything sweet, you're never going to get them to go back. They probably won't even eat the bubbles anymore. And so you want to do vegetables first and give you slow and you want to do one vegetable at a time so like carrots every day for breakfast for a week and if nothing happens then you move on to something else Ugh, rant done all right so the next thing I want to talk to you guys about is the intimate moment so I'm telling you guys like as they age oh my gosh this is the best part when they're like three to nine months or so because that love that you get from that baby is so freaking pure it's like they love you more than they love themselves they love you more than anything in this world and you can totally tell just the way that they look at you and they laugh at you and it's just it's just a good time so the intimate moments are something to be expecting around three months or so and it is just the best time because it is the purest love speaking of love I think I hear a baby. All right, so that was a false alarm. So I'm gonna be honest, I'm a little disappointed because I really wanted someone to join the party, but that's all right. Maybe they'll start to get a little fussy within the next like uh, 10 minutes or so, just when I start getting done with what I'm doing. The next thing I wanna talk about is talking. So last month we talked about how the babies were cooing. So they start to coo when they are trying to get like your attention or when they see you talking to them, that's like their response. And now we're moving on from cooing to what I like to call talking. Obviously it's not actually talking. But it's like their own version of talking. So they're making more sounds than just the coos and they're making like more complicated sounds, but it's nothing like actual language. But it's still really freaking cute. And you can tell that they're trying to get your attention because they're saying it at you this happens at three months or around three months um, that's at least how it's going for us and it is beautiful so both babies are doing all the things that we've talked about and we're just having the best freaking time you guys all right so the next thing I want to talk about is movement so last month we talked about how Amira was starting to roll now Azara and Amira are both starting to roll Amira has done a couple rolls and a couple half rolls so we really got to be careful with what she's doing and then Azara has done like a little bit of couple half rolls but no full rolls yet so you have to be really careful with what you're doing with the babes around three months and even around two months as far as movement goes, we still do a lot of tummy time because it keeps them active and it keeps them really strong and it keeps their heads flopping and going like little bobbleheads. 
Autumn has joined the party. Hello. Autumn and Azara have joined the party. Okay, guys, another thing to watch out for with movement is the scooting. So Amira is really, really freaking good at scooting herself, isn't she? She, like, locks her legs and, like, Oh. <laughs> did I just like squeeze that why? out of you? <laughs> why did I was about to say why did it happen right when you moved? I thought it was you for a second. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so the scooting. So Amira will like lock her legs and push herself up and she will like fall and like flatten and she'll like fall right. She could easily fall right out of the swing or right out of the bouncer, so we have to be really careful with that. And you should be watching that for your baby too. Alright, the last thing I want to talk about as far as moving is, is play. So you're gonna notice that your baby wants to play more and it's so freaking cute. Like, Amira has been like grabbing at things. Well, I guess I should say cute and dangerous. Because Amira has been grabbing at a lot more stuff and she's been playing with toys. But she also grabs my freaking face and tries to pull it off of my head like a zombie child. <laughs> Alright guys, that's it for today's video. Hopefully you enjoyed it. If you're new here, thanks for watching and thanks for subscribing. On this channel, we do a bunch of family-friendly stuff. So we do pranks, we do reactions, we do baby freaking changing things and a whole bunch of other stuff so if you want to know more you have to watch and if you've been keeping up with our videos guys leave a comment down below so we know who you are and for a shout out because if you're giving love we want to get some love back to you so i'm out of breath for today but make sure to stay tuned for some more videos we have a ton of content coming to you and we're very excited to be bringing it also if you want to leave a comment down below and let us know what you want to see we would love to bring you that video and with all that being said with all that being done 18 bye.